Liang Yi boxing is one of 126 martial arts forms recognized by the Chinese Wushu Association, a non-governmental organization established in 1958 to manage martial arts nationally. This form of martial arts originated in a village in central China's Hunan Province. Duan Baohua, a master of the form, told us about its effectiveness. Liang Yi Quan. The brilliance of Liang Yi boxing is that by attacking the acupoint, one can subdue the enemy without hurting him. The enemy is paralyzed and unable to fight back. I'm, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> The other function of this kung fu is to maintain good health. Practicing Liang Yi boxing facilitates the flow and the circulation of energy in one's body. Liang Yi boxing also helps fight crimes and keep people safe. Chinese law enforcement, such as People's Armed Police and Central Government Secret Service, have invited me to train the police. Unlike many kung fu practitioners, Duan also excels at Chinese calligraphy. He said one's mastery of martial arts can also be reflected in one's writing. When he began to practice Liang Yi boxing, his strokes were rigid and stiff. But as he became more adept at the martial art, his writing became calmer and more smooth. Born in 1960, Duan has been practicing Liang Yi boxing since childhood. He's been utilizing the form for more than 40 years. He claims that it has helped him look and feel younger. The rules for teaching Liang Yi boxing used to be strict. In ancient times, only one male member of each generation of a particular family could be allowed to learn Liang Yi boxing. But in 1991, Zhang Yaoting, former president of the Chinese Wushu Association, Found Duan and persuaded him to teach the form to people outside of his family. Duan then opened his first martial arts school in his hometown. He has had more than 3,000 apprentices thus far, and Liangyi boxing has since been listed as a form of intangible national cultural heritage.